I had raised the cap on interest earned per round to 20. Ooh. Have at least 30 cards with diamond suit. Played cards with diamond suit earn a dollar when scored. Enhance 16 cards in your deck. Times 3 molt if you have at least 16 enhanced cards in your full deck. Nebula deck. Win a run with the blue deck. Start run with the telescope voucher and minus one consumable slot. That sounds pretty good. Alright, I think we'll do one last round with Nebula and then I'll be done for tonight. Adds one voucher, that doesn't seem helpful. Um, yeah, we'll fish for the full house. Like, Ace is full of kings, that's a pretty good hand. Plus one hand size, and that's always good. I'll take that now, while it exists. But I guess technically if I was going to take that, I should have waited until next turn so I could have gotten some interest. Unless I think the hand size will be impactful to this particular round, which I don't think will be the case, but you never know. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. You know, to complain about playing a straight. Two pair jacks and kings could work, but let's go ahead and discard to make it kings full of jacks. So I guess with Nebula, because we start with the uh, telescope, we probably would pretty quickly decide on like what our run is about so we can take advantage of the telescope. So like right now, for example, our full house is our most common thing. So let's, I guess we'll buy the thing and just buy Earths. Make loads of full houses. I don't think either of those help us much. Minus one hand size. Well, joke's on you. I already had plus one hand size. Anyway. That is pretty bad. <laughs> like... <laughs> Really not getting much here. I guess we'll play aces and fives, two pair. Well, there's the other five we needed. Uh, I think I'm gonna die here. I don't I don't know what we're gonna do about this. Seems pretty bad. I mean three of a kind kings? Anyone? Like I mean that wasn't a real run, come on. I don't really feel need to reroll the boss blind. Okay, maybe we make it a flush deck. Right? Flush is pretty easy. To reliably hits. It's pretty obvious how you like modify your deck to build around it. Plant cards appear two times more frequently in the shop. Do we really want that? I don't, last time I feel like our shop got like really clogged with a bunch of cards we didn't want. Plus eight multi if your hand contains a pair. Not likely with playing flushes. When blind is selected, create two common jokers. It's better than nothing. And we could even, like, sell the jokers as a form of income. Okay, so if we're doing flushes, we should decide on a suit that we want to focus on. Or we could just turn something into a wild card. That could actually be the better play. We could just turn this king wild. That way we're still flexible if we come across things that like particularly help one suit or another we haven't already committed. That makes sense to me. Okay, we have to-do list. Poker 
hand is a high card, I get stuff. One in two chance to create a tarot card when any booster pack is opened. Okay. And I guess I should start off by playing high card. So I'll play like high card 10 as basically a discard. And now we're going for club flush. Uh, we have the most diamonds in the deck, but we've got, like, none out on the field. I think we go for the spade flush here. And we got it, luckily. Alright. Spectral pack. I do like me a spectral pack. Add a blue seal to a... So that'll get us more planets. Create a copy of random joker. I mean, none of our jokers are that good. Destroy five random cards. Add foil, holographic, or polychrome effect to one selected card in hand. I think we actually just immolate. And that'll sort of tell us... All right, now we have a more dark focus deck. Less hearts, more less diamonds, more spades. Let's go again. Add a purple seal. That'll give us more tarot cards. That's good for deck fixing. Destroy a random card in your hand. Add three random enhanced face cards to your hand. And enhanced cards are pretty good. Create a copy of a random joker. Destroy all others. Add a blue seal. Give me... Medium on the four of spades. I guess I wouldn't mind getting walk talkie, though this guy's giving us more jokers next time, I think, so it's not really of much concern. I think we just go. Alright, eight molt if played hand contains a pair, plus fifteen molt when zero discards remain. Earn five dollars if poker hand is a straight. Um, do we have straights available? Not really. We could get one actually pretty easily. Ten jack, queen, king, ace. Okay, now... You're wild, so we'll keep you. Okay. And I guess it would be better to not use the wild cards if we don't have to, or the uh, debuffed cards. Okay. Uh, five bucks if I get two pair. Yeah, I don't like this because we don't play pairs. We also don't play pairs, really. So get out of here. Give me a judgment, that could be fun. And I guess that's okay. Buffoon back. Two chips for each remaining card in the deck. We're kind of thinning our deck. This seems fun. Oops, all six is double all listed probabilities. Oh, we can convert cards to spades. That's good. And heck, a standard pack might actually be worthwhile. Yeah, we could buy this foil king of spades. Next round. I'll skip for a rare joker. Sure. Could be useful. And I'd rather wait until we have like more red cards to use the world. Like, this is a pretty good opportunity. Welcome to Spadesville. Oops, that's not a spade, that is a club. High card. Oh, that's a club too. Okay. We'll discard these guys then. Do 
And actually, I should probably max out my discard so I get that plus 15 molts. Right? Like, I'm not crazy for thinking that, am I? Okay, that went pretty well. Obviously, our Oops All Sixes is doing literally nothing right now. Our driver's license, if we can get that many enhanced cards. Here, let's sell this. Let's get driver's license. Because I like the idea of it, in theory. We'll buy Emperor. See what that gets us. Lovers. Uh, and I guess we'll buy, like, a bunch of Jupiters to enhance our flesh capabilities. Raise all blinds or fresh blinds. Oh, this has a two and two chance to create a tarot when any booster pack is opened. Huh. Oh wait, we only have. Oh, I was. Oh, I was stupid. Okay, we only have one slot. What? A, first hand is drawn face down. What the heck? Okay. I mean, let's get rid of cards. I don't know what they are. At least. Okay. And we have so many more spade. Well, it's just got maximize for spade potential. There we go. And I guess here's I'll use lovers to turn this ace of clubs into a wild. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. So we buy packs first. Because then I get my thing. Um, give me a Jupiter. So we can turn Fool into Jupiter. That actually makes a lot of sense. Use that. We'll buy a standard pack because that also gets us a tarot card. Tower is terrible, so we'll just... Ignore that and not buy anything here. I'll buy the seed money. And let's get Empress so we can start buffing our cards. We don't really play straights. Okay, so Empress, you're going to buff these two. Very nice. Uh, pair? Oh. Oh, I didn't notice that. Okay, we'll, we'll need to change that to a better suit at some point. Clearly. We're up to three. That's fine. I'll buy an Arcana pack. Got me the Fool. With, with, with the Fool, I can actually use that right now to get an Empress, which I can then use on these. Great. Then I can turn something into a glass. Gold might be nicer for now. Well. We'll make this six glass, why not? Give me a spectral pack. Creates a random rare joker. Mm. Converse to a random suit? I'm not feeling that. But uh, I should have used the chariot. Oh well. Plus three molds for each Joker card currently existing. And that's just strictly better than Mystic Summit. Right? Yeah. Moving on. 15 bucks after the boss? Do I want to do that? Maybe. Sure. Right, extra large blind. It's fine. I'm not afraid of this. Right, we discard these guys. 
I'm, I'm aware, by the way, that I already have a straight. What I'm waiting for, though, is... Okay, we take a chariot. Oh, okay. Chariot, we'll put you on the two. And now... We'll have a really good flush with a steel card. And we'd ideally like to propagate the steel cards a bit more throughout the deck. Okay, we still have a discard. Let's not discard the aces. We'll discard these guys. This pair of aces is playable, at least. We can do pair of aces plus a bunch of riffraff. All right. More hand size is always going to be good. Definitely want the world, but we shouldn't buy it yet. We should wait until we buy our celestial packs. Because we can't use it immediately. Uh, okay, Jupiter, obviously. Now, the issue with the devils, we can't use it immediately. Hmm. Let's see if we can get a better one. The Emperor, I mean, we'll see what we get. Enhance two cards or get more spades. I think we want to get more. S well, if we enhance cards, it'll get us closer to driver's license. How's our spades looking? I'd like more spades in the deck. I think right now we need more spades. Driver's license will take care of itself. Oh, this might be good. Plus one mold per tarot card used this run. And Seltzer's almost gone anyway. We are using a lot of tarot cards. Okay. Get a Mega Arcana pack. We can't use it right now anyway. Alright, world. Oh, yeah. We're eating good tonight. Well, hold on. That's already functionally a spade. So, I guess eight of clubs? Congratulations. Welcome to Spadesville. And I wish I could get, like, a flush full house. That'd be fun. First played face card gives times two molt when scored. But I have to play face cards. How much of my deck is face cards? Like, a normal amount, I guess? Maybe slightly above average? I don't know. I'm not sure that's actually that good. Give me an Arcana pack, though. Judgment. I don't think I really want a random Joker. I'm kind of satisfied with what we have. And we could probably do better than Abstract Joker. I could give it a shot. And we don't need to do it immediately. Uh, what we do need to do is copy this King of Spades, though. That's for certain. And the 7 is going to us get copied. Alright, let's... It is foil, but... Look, you gotta be bold. Let's get a random joker. Crafty joker. Plus 80 chips if played hand contains a flush. That's not bad. And we're not getting malts, but... I mean, I'm not... I think that was mostly just a lateral move, I'd say. Tower sucks for what we're trying to achieve. What would this be? This would become... Judgment? What does Judgment do again? Get some planet cards? Mm. I think maybe we just add some molts, honestly. And then we buy the world. I don't think we buy this Joker. We don't need more hand size. Okay, world gets these. Welcome to being a spade. Hope you like it. Alright, we need seven more enhanced cards before driver's license starts working. Okay, we need to discard before this hand starts working. Oh, that's a straight flush, by the way. Pretty good. 
Good stuff. I don't really think there's a place for the banana. Star, we don't need. I'll take Jupiter, though. Certainly we'll take Jupiter. Let's take a look at the pack. If there's cool spades, we can take them. I mean, a malted queen spade. That's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I'll use that. Sure. Get some cash. Cards played previously this anti are debuffed. Alright. I'm not overly concerned about that. We've got a lot of spades to choose from in the deck. Not to mention, debuffed spades can be, still be used to make a spade, a, uh, a flush. Like so. That's high card. How? Does the wild not work? Wild. Oh, abilities are disabled. Hmm, that's annoying. Still did it in one. I mean, strength is fine. Let's definitely uh, buy this voucher. More interest. Seems good. Jupiter, please. I don't need more hearts in my life. Uh, give me... Give me seven of spades with the gold seal. I think that's actually better than the gold ten of spades. And yeah, you're definitely keeping death. That is for certain. Next base edition shop. Eh, holographic joker. Don't mind a Foil King. What else in the deck would we rather copy than the Foil King? And maybe Molt Aces? No! I played the hand. Okay, well, let's go fishing for something better to duplicate then. Class 6, I would be okay with, I guess. Let's play it. Yeah, that's rough, because now the death is going to mess with our ability to get more cards. Let's Arcana pack it, though. Maybe we can use it here. I mean, I guess we can duplicate the seven. And then we'll world these. How many cl uh, we've got 30 spades at this point. Destroy some cards. Magician, make a lucky card. Ooh, okay, let's make this jack lucky. And then we'll actually use death on the jack to turn the six into a lucky jack. Very nice. Next round, please. I think the opportunity in the shop is very important for us. I don't think we just don't go to the shop. Because every time we go to the shop, we can do all sorts of fun stuff with tarot cards. Ten four isn't really what we want. Plus three malt. We don't skip booster packs here. Destroy one random card in your hand. Add four random enhanced numbered cards. That could help us get to the driver's license. We'll try it. Enhanced cards are fun. 
makes the deck slightly less consistent, but driver's license now works, which is huge. Up the ante. All right, um, let's make the tan here wild. So now it effectively counts as a spade. Let's see what driver's license does for us now. That's actually slightly underwhelming, honestly. Yeah, I'll take some extra discards. DNA. You know, am I insane for thinking? Because we've fixed our jet deck quite a bit already. Like, what, what would be the card we would want to DNA specifically? I don't know. I don't know. I, maybe the tarot cards are still more useful. DNA is pretty good, though. Pretty good. Maybe get rid of Oops All Sixes. What's that doing for us, really? We're crafty joker. Or maybe it's too late for DNA. We're pretty far in. Yeah. Let's just buy a buffoon pack. Blackboard. Okay, now we're talking. All right, I think you get rid of oops all sixes for this. Yes. Let's wheel fortune. Oh, holographic fortune teller. Okay, so now, if all the cards in hand are spades or clubs, we get times three molds. That's huge. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll. I guess I'll use the fool to get another wheel of fortune. I just well use it now. Okay. Mega standard pack. Mm, I, I'll just take the money. Thank you very much. So, okay. So now we specifically want to discard red cards. There we go. I guess we'll avoid using the glass unless we have to, because I'd rather not break the glass. That was kind of underwhelming. Did I even play a flush? Th there we go. That, that's more like what I was thinking I should have. I don't... I think it's too late for Space Joker. Give me the Celestial Pack. I'll take a Jupiter. Yeah, I'm gonna actually full Wheel of Fortune first. And then I'll take a Jupiter. Because I think we're close to having, like, our endgame jokers. So if we can get them, like, polychromed up and stuff, that would be a great boon, I think. Okay. I would like to get... I'm still in getting involved here. would be pretty sweet. But to make Blackboard work more reliably, we really want to be getting rid of the red cards in our deck. Actually, call me crazy, I'm gonna copy the red steel. Or the, the, the two of steel. Like how many red cards do we have? We've got eight red cards in total in the deck. Must play five cards? We always play five cards. That is not a problem. Discard this too. Hanged man. Okay, that could be useful. Could come up. I'd prefer to focus on hanging red cards specifically. And obviously clubs are not as good as spades, but if we can get a red card out of here, that's worth something.
Pretty good. We don't really need Venus in our life. Hate the tower. Uh, I mean, we don't really need money. Yeah, the world convert some spades. That sounds delightful. Okay, only five red cards remain. Five cards. Of love and flesh. I wouldn't mind some more base malt. Arcana pack. Lovely stuff. Strength. I don't mind having an extra ace, I guess. There you go. Um, could make it lucky, make it glass. I think I'd rather be lucky than glass. I mean, the glass cards I think are pretty good. It's just, they can be destroyed. Plus 10 malt if you play it, if played hand contains a flush. Is, well, okay, let's think about this. So it's 10 malt, but that 10 malt is going to then be times three, so 30 malt, then times three again, so 90 malt. So it's more than the chips quantity. So I think that's better than Crafty Joker. Probably. Maybe it's time to get rid of Hallucination. I think that actually makes a lot of sense. Plus five hand size reduces by one every round. I don't think we need that. Another card available in the shop though. Now that's nice. And there's no reason not to buy and use Temperance. Next round. A Mega Arcana pack? Sure. Okay. Let's see. Glass card. Hmm. Some Malt. Some money. Yeah, maybe it's time to start making glass cards. I'll make a glass queen. And I guess we'll enhance, get some malts going too. Choose two planets. Let's just do it. Hold on, we gotta discard. Gotta get rid of the red cards first, of course. This works for me. All right. Cash out. Plus two malts. We don't play pairs. That's just 15 malts. I guess I'll buy Neptune. Like we might do a straight flush at some point. Have we ever done a straight flush? Um, once. I'll take a look at the buffoon pack. Odd Todd and Faceless Joker. No. And you definitely want more Jupiter in your life. Lose one dollar per card played. I don't think that'll be much of an issue. There we go. Don't even need to discard. 340,000. Now, how do we take this run to the next level, I wonder? And an extra hand per round is not bad, certainly. Yeah, I kind of am missing my tarot cards, honestly. Maybe we shouldn't have sold 
the Joker giving us those tarot cards. And Wrathful Joker? That'll be plus 20 malt. Which is more than we get from Droll Joker. Let's get rid of Crafty Joker, I guess? I don't know. How many chips are we getting? It's like our flesh gives 230 chips. Okay, well, we know for a fact that Wrathful Joker is a straight upgrade over Droll Joker, so let's, let's put it there. Gives a dollar per hand played this run. I mean, that's pretty good. But I want to actually go to the shop to buy things. All right, money's not the concern here. The concern is being able to purchase stuff. The opportunity to purchase is worth something. And if we had more steel cards, I think that would be really good. But how would we go about getting more steel cards? Like, I just broke my glass queen. It's fine. I, I don't think we're doing Vagabond here. Alright, Arcana Pack. Thank you. Glass. I want steel. And I'll take glass, I guess. Adds the number of times Poker Hand has been played to Molt, which is currently 21. Is 21 Molt better than 80 chips? Because, remember, the 21 malt is then going to get multiplied by 3. So it's going to be 63 malt. And then that's going to get multiplied, so it's going to be 189 malt. I mean, that's got to be better than 80 chips. Plus, it's going to increase over time. We'll see how this does. I guess I could buy, in theory. Some steel cards. Double tag. You know what? Give me that. Yeah. A Cerulean Bell forces one card to always be selected. Luckily, that one card is basically always going to be a spade, isn't it? And that's a lot of molt. <laughs> Alright, let's try endless mode. See how far we can get. Got a lot of money. An additional consumable slot, I think, would be very useful. Oh, hallucination's back! I do miss hallucination. I think hallucination will be more useful in the long run than Wrathful Joker. That may be an unpopular opinion, but it's my opinion. Yeah, give me a spectral pack. Okay. Uh, add foil or polychrome and stuff. I mean, that's useful. Polychrome, especially. Definitely don't want that. I uh, definitely don't want that. And converting all the cards to a, a random rank could be useful, because then we could start doing flush five, but we've already upgraded flush so much. I'm not sure flush five actually is the way to go here. I think we probably just aura the ace. Okay. Oh, I guess we get another one. You know what? Let's try it. They're all jacks now. Cool. Emperor, lovely stuff. I don't really want any of these. Hermit, I mean, why not use it? Sun, why not sell it? Do we reroll? Each played six of spades gives, but that's gonna change. So it's not really good. You can't build around that. Okay. Well, okay, you gotta start by discarding your red cards. 
And actually, you discard the seal. We need more purple seals. That's what we need. Ideally, ones that don't produce that nonsense. So we might experiment to see how good a flush five is at base. And maybe we could transfer to focusing flush five, perhaps. This joker gains three chips for a discarded club, plus one hand size. I mean, that's not bad, but it's not good. I mean, of these, I mean, we could turn the eight wild, but I think the wheel of fortune is better. Never mind. It did literally nothing. Emperor, get two, two cards, maybe? Glass and Molt. I mean, that's not bad. It's not bad. I prefer Steel. None of this seems to help much. I don't really need a Foil Joker. Like, we're winning very easily right now, but that could change very quickly. But even that wasn't all that impressive. Alright, give me a buy news, come on. Eventually that's gonna work. Um Give me an Arcana pack. I should have used those during the last hand. Oh well, you live and learn. Alright, uh give me a glass jack, I suppose. And a molted. I guess I'll molt these two, since they're the only ones that don't have anything going on. Yeah, give me death. Yeah, death. I guess I'll copy the lucky ace. I guess I'll fool. Get some death again. I guess really, because I've got a lot of jacks. I've got 13 jacks. If anything, I should be copying jacks on aces. For next time. Jupiter, thank you. I guess we'll use the Emperor later. All face cards are debuffed. Well, that's mildly annoying. We can slide one in, and that shouldn't affect things too much. It affected for things a fair bit, as it turns out. And this is a flush, but it's a pretty terrible one. With all the debuffs. Didn't matter. Didn't matter anyway. None of these are really good. Oh, I should have used those. Mm, you gotta use your cards, man. Use the tarot cards next time. Even if you don't, like, have to. Use them. Use them or lose them. I don't need the Mega Celestial pack. I need to use my tarot cards. Okay, Steel Jack. Now that's good. Let's get rid of the 10, honestly. Left into right. There we go. And now what's Emperor going to give us? Tower sucks. Hermit. I mean, it's free money. I should discard this to get another tarot card. Wheel of Fortune. Don't mind if I do. Alright. Let's see how this does. With two steel jacks. And there's a limit to how many steel cards we can reasonably utilize at a time. Since we only have a hand size of eight. Uh, 
I mean, give me a standard pack. A foil ten of spades seems pretty sweet. Do we? I guess we can still be converting stuff to spades. I guess one nice thing about our current build is if we think things are starting to get dicey, we can always just swap out Hallucination for, like, any other Joker. And that will give us a lot more opportunity, I think. Like a world. We'll wait. We'll hold off for a moment. This'll do. And I guess I'll... Yeah. Welcome to the realms of being a... Spade. Alright. That's not useful. It's not really that useful. And more chips isn't terrible. Hanged man. And we could get rid of some clubs. I think I'd rather wheel fortuneless. I think I'll turn uh, five into glass. And then I'll wheel of fortune. And hopefully it'll land on one of these. Come on, it, it, the wheel of fortune's gotta hit sometime, right? Okay, um, give me a magician turning this queen lucky. I think I'd rather get emperor. Okay, that gives us another shot at wheel fortune. Okay, it's a uh, holographic hallucination plus 10 molt. That's not bad. Now it gives some molt as well as utility. One million. All right, let's turn this 10 into a jack. And I guess we can turn the seven into an eight. Or the queen into a king. Yeah, queen into king makes sense. Okay, this needs to go, this needs to go. This seems fine to me. That was a pair. Not to worry. This should be good. Why is this high card? Oh. Okay, hold on. Discard, discard. There we go. That's a real hand. Okay. Fine. I would like to discard this four, but we'll play it safe. Just in case this doesn't work. It did. Though if we discarded the four, it could have come back as like a red card, potentially. Plus 13 molts for each queen held in hand. I don't think that does much for us, honestly. Alright, give me... Yeah, give me the clearance sale, sure. I'll open up a celestial pack. Jupiter, of course. Who else? Okay, so our next blind is. It's only. F oh, no, we defeated all that stuff. Okay. Hold on, though. But our next blind, though. Alright, it better not be ridiculous, because I, I don't want to die with a bunch of money in my pocket. Is there anything we could buy here? Times three if it contains three of a kind? And we could probably like, make that happen. We've got 15 jacks in the deck. Most of which are spades. 12 jacks of spades in the deck. The issue, though, is... 
Well... Okay, I think we sell this, we buy this, try to get three of the kind jacks in our flushes, and see where that takes us. I guess I might as well buy and use this. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Played spade played cards with spade suit give plus fifty chips when scored. So this is plus 250 chips every round. That seems significant. That might be better than some of our molt stuff. I don't know. This is 58 molt. This is 32 molt. I mean, is 32 molt really gonna be better than 250 chips? Especially considering, I think right now our molt is far exceeding our chips. So I, because th what is this actually? So if it's, we'll just say thirty for simplicity's sake. Thirty, which then gets multiplied by three into ninety, which then gets multiplied by three into two hundred seventy, which then gets multiplied into three into what? I guess. Short of 900, like 810? 810 molt versus 250 chips. But the thing we gotta consider is then when everything gets like balanced out here, right? This molt is gonna be like over a thousand, like, like 2000 roughly. Well, this is gonna be like a similar sort of thing, like 250 ish to. Or not 250. 180 into 560? No, not 560. 460? Anyways, it's a, it's a lot. We're talking roughly probably a bit over 2,000 molts as compared to... The chips here. I don't know. Because I feel like we're sort of unbalanced. We, we make a lot more molts than chips. So in theory, like I think the max, you'd want it to be more balanced, but I'm not sure I'm more willing to give anything up to make that happen. Because we only have the five joker slots, but if we don't change something, we're likely gonna die. Alright, I'm gonna go on a lark here and sell Supernova. It might be a terrible decision, but I think it's the only thing I sensibly can do right now. Might as well buy a Magician. We trigger all cards held in hand. Card in hell. Hel so that'd be good for like, re-triggering the Steel cards. But I don't, I don't know what we could replace is the, the issue. I forget the lovers. Give me the Hierophants. Okay. 7.2 million. Double tag. Okay. Let's go. Hopefully I haven't like screwed up my whole deck. We need to get three of a kind jacks. That's important. Okay. Like this. This is probably better. Let's see what this does for us. Two million. Uh... Okay. We need to fish for more jacks. The six could be good. Okay, three jacks. This needs to go. Okay, good job, Jax. The six to kick things off over here. The glass six. 
with a steel two in hand. Okay. I have no more discards. I guess we'll see how we can do without the jacks. Okay, I think we'll make it past this one at least. Uh, we do need to... How many more... Okay, I think we're gonna play high card king here. Because we, we need blackboard to work. <laughs> okay, uh, club flush. That still works, I think. Uh, Airhead is going to do like nothing, but hopefully we have enough molt to make the difference. Okay. Okay. Um, that was too close. I don't think Arrowhead... Uh, there's a lot of problems, honestly. And we didn't use either of these. Great. Um... Okay, first we magician this jack. No, we don't. That's a jack of clubs. What the heck, man? We could strength the 10 into a jack. We choose two of these. I think, yeah, that's what we do. We strength the 10 into a jack. And I guess we tee up the 9 as well. We wheel of fortune. Okay, of course, that's the one that got holographic, the one I'm thinking of getting rid of. Rid of. Um, great. We, I think maybe base molt would be better. Great, this is giving some base molt now, not a ton. But that's a third of the amount of molt we were getting before from that slot. That could be significant. Give me a strength. That could be a good utility to get those jacks rolling. And a negative joker would really hit the spot. We haven't seen, like, any this run. And I'm re-rolling a bunch right now because I don't... Mm, plus four molts when scored. And that's going to be double the molt, but no chips. Okay, I think that's all the rolling I can do. Skip the blind? Nah. Okay. Strength. We have three of a kind jack. That's the wrong type of jack. Okay, great. Like, actually getting the three of a kind jacks is actually really important for us now. I really don't want to be wasting all of these discards, but... Okay, you know what? We'll do one without the jacks first, but these glass cards should hopefully make up for the fact that there are no jacks. Okay, two million. I mean, we can see what the flush five looks like, at least. 160 times 16, whereas a normal flush is going to be... Isn't this a spade? Three fifty times forty six. So I mean, this is just worse. <laughs> I don't want four of a kind. I want. Oh, this is. Oh no. Um, I've got too many jacks now. I don't want to use the steel card. But I don't want to waste discards either, so I think it's going to have to be like this. I mean, actually, 
Here's what you do. You take the world, you turn this two into a spade. As well as these, I guess. There. Be spaded. Okay. This is gonna be a close one. We got steel jacks now. Okay, we can strength this 10 into a jack and might as well strength the six. Actually, how many aces do I have? We can strength the king into an ace. So now we have these two jacks plus the spade and the, that's a club. That's a darn club. Okay. Um, we still have two steel jacks. Which should help with the scoring. Okay, we're, uh, we're gonna make it past this hand. The boss? Eh, not so sure about that. Okay, we might as well discard the queen and the ace. That's the worst thing that could possibly happen. You, we have to play this. Because otherwise blackboard doesn't work and everything falls apart. Okay. Do we need to play the three jacks? Flush house is not very good. This should still work, regardless. We only need like a million points. Okay, that was 12 million. I don't know what our out is here. And we could try going back to Supernova, which would give us 40 molts. Look, if we don't change anything, we're dead, like, almost immediately regardless. So I'd say we swap out the Arrowhead for Supernova, and at least we've tried something to get things back on track. Open up a Buffoon Pack, could be a good Joker in there. None of these really are relevant, unfortunately. Spectral is wacky, but you never know. Add a negative to a random joker and minus one hand size yeah know what negative making a joker negative so we can effectively have one extra one there there's something to that okay supernova is negative so now we want to get like any joker or not literally any well 50 chips i'll buy you for now as a placeholder in case nothing better comes up we'll buy death of course But having a chips joker could be good. Especially since we have the malt pretty well under control. And right, I'll do one more roll. We aren't really doing aces. And this could be great, but it's only one in four chance that it'll be spades. Which is the only thing we play. So, yeah. I meant to go to the next round. <laughs> okay, all face cards are drawn face down. Uh, how are we going to deal with this? What do we have that aren't jacks? We've got a good amount of kings. Okay, okay, Here, here's what we can do. We take death. Death is what? Convert left into right. Okay, great. So we take death. 30 chips or seven or four molts. I think, give me, make, turn it into a bonus, actually. So we turn this into a seven. Use. Right, now these we know for sure are face cards. I have a single i've got two face cards in the deck that could mess me up but you, you, you gotta do what you gotta do okay and these are all probably spades then since sorting my suit didn't do anything 
Here's my thought process. Jacks are low suit, so this is the most likely to have three jacks. It did not have three jacks. That's devastating. I mean, like these, hold on, hold on. These definitely aren't jacks. I mean, you do what you can. There we go, three jacks, perfect. Okay, we have two more hands. And you gotta believe in the jacks. Three jacks, that's what you need to see. Okay, discards. These could be jacks. It could be like anything, really. This might be wacky, but I think we do this. This is pretty likely to be three jacks, but you never know. Two jacks, and that's the game, I think. Welp, tried my best. It's the best you can ask for. To the main menu. Oh, I unlocked a Joker. From Airhead, great. Have at least 30 cards with spade suit in your deck. Went around without playing a three of a kind. Got the trio. Have at least five glass cards in your deck. I got the, the glass. Joker, I guess. Gains times 0 0.5 molt for every glass card that is destroyed. Ooh, that's an interesting idea. I do use a lot of arcane cards. Spectral cards may appear in any of the arcana packs. Mm hmm, interesting. I played a lot of face cards, so I got retrigger all played face cards. Ooh. Planet cards in your consumable area give times 1.5 molt for their specified poker hands. That's interesting. Upgrade the level of the first discarded poker hand each round. Add the sell value of all owned jokers left of this card to molt. Huh. Sheesh, I unlocked a lot of stuff. Lose five runs. Come on, man. Prevent death if chips scored are at least 25% of the required chips. Self-destructs. Play 200 hands. Times three molts on final hand of round. Okay. Well, anyways, guys, this has been Balatro. Hope you guys enjoyed. Who knows? Maybe we'll play some more. Maybe not. I don't know. I certainly have enjoyed my time with it. Fun game. But until next time, I've been Simicraft, and I will catch you in another stream or video soon. Goodbye.